Hello guys, my, um, <laughs> welcome back to my channel. Um, I just want to give you guys a quick update on why I haven't been uploading. I just wanted to give you guys a little bit backstory on on myself. Um, um, as you guys know, by now I have uh, six kids. Um, my my third pregnancy. Um, uh, this one when I was pregnant with her. Uh, yeah, that's pretty drawing. It's nice. When I was pregnant with her, um, I had um, I have a hard time with her. Um, she was kind of a little bit big, and believe me, I'm five three, and I'm like a hundred twenty pounds. So, anyways, um, she was a kind of a big baby. And I was in labor with her for 30, I think it was 30 hours. And the hospital that I went to, um, I went there, I went there because, you know, I was having contractions. And then we got there and automatically the doctor told me that they weren't going to keep me, even though I was dilated at three. She said, uh, you're, um, we're not keeping you because you're not in pain, you're just, you're talking and you're not crying or screaming and we, we thought that it was weird. So, we left, we left and my boyfriend, you know, my whole family, they were all upset on why they did that to me and then we went to a different hospital that was much closer to the one I went to and they told me that they don't deliver there. So, um, so we just went home, they gave me some, um, I don't remember the medication that they gave me, but they gave me that and they told me that um, it was going to uh, help me with the pain. So I took that, of course that didn't help, I slept with contractions. And then my boyfriend's like, let's go, I'm not going to keep you home like this, let's go. So by 9 o'clock in the morning came, um, he told me, um, maybe it's a different doctor. So I said, okay. You know, I was in so much pain. Um, we get to the hospital and I was dilated at, I think it was at 6. Dilated at six, and we told the doctor what this other doctor did and why she sent us home. And then they were like, She wasn't supposed to be doing that. Why did she do that? And I don't know what happened with the doctor. So I had my baby, and then um, I believe I lost um, quite a, a good amount of blood. I lost a lot. And and ever since then I didn't know like my blood level was so low was so low since then and um, before I was pregnant with my last baby right here um, I was feeling like I don't know I was off I didn't feel like myself I felt dizzy I didn't have no energy I um, you know just off balance type of thing um, so I go to the hospital and they told me nothing's wrong everything came back negative I'm not diabetic I'm you know good and then I, I was like I don't believe this hospital I, so when I found out that was I was pregnant with him I go to a different hospital and and here that's when I told them my experience because I kind of had a um, are you okay I kind of had a um, anxiety attack like in Walmart like literally I was panicking like my heart was racing I was sweating I was I couldn't breathe in my mask was, I felt like I needed to faint I was shaking 
I just I get, I told my doctor about that, and then they told they test me, and they told me that my um lot my iron dropped. My iron had dropped to a four. I think it was four. And then they told me when your iron's so low, you get anxiety attack. And I never experienced that. So, of course, from there, they told me um, they were going to give me iron supplements. And then they injected me twice. Um, they injected me twice. I wish I would recorded for you guys but at that time I wasn't doing YouTube so anyways um, after that I felt great I, I was doing stuff again I was actually like cleaning more I was being myself more I wasn't having no anxiety attacks like just going into a store you know I would freak out but you know COVID being around too you can I had that problem too but anyways um i was just feeling better and happy energized Mom, you know Mom, and I here know um, like, like a month ago i believe i like this yeah that's so pretty um i kind of felt off balance like i was just sitting on our, our um couch this ultimate alt, alt, i don't know what it's called but I was sitting on here and I felt like I was losing balance, like I was falling off. I don't know, and then my heart just started beating like crazy again, like what the hell's going on? And then I remember I stopped taking my iron pills for like maybe two, three weeks. And here, uh, I was like, maybe it's that. So I go back to the hospital and I got my refills and been taking them for a while and I'm getting back to myself again to where I'm actually doing stuff I'm up uh, just feeling really feeling myself again um, which is kind of scary I wish you know it would go away but it's just I don't know but See what happens but for now I'm taking the iron pills and I'm doing a lot better um, I was just freaking out like damn like I've been low on blood for all this time and I just found out that um, the doctor told me um, I can't have no more kids me, which is fine with me and my partner uh, you know just for my health I have to be there for my kids uh, be healthy for them you know, which is scary I don't want to bring no baby into this world with me being like this you know they're such a blessing but I'm just told I can't have no more which which is sad but six is good for me um, yeah that was kind of my story I wanted to tell you guys and, but I know there's a lot of people that deal with this and I'm not the only one and then I really didn't talk to anybody about this I kept it in and yeah I just wanted to update you guys my little story oh and I hurt my finger I was cleaning my kids room the other day and um, I was wiping down their bed and in the middle of my nail like half of it right here like half of my nail is you know cracked all this finger and it hurts but okay well I don't mean to tell a whole story here so um like comment subscribe please give me a thumbs up continue
watching my videos. I see a bit of Yeah. Um, what else do I need to tell you guys? Uh, I'll be uploading more now that I'm back to myself. So happy. Bye. Bye, guys.